What drew me to uh, the program here was mostly the research that they were doing here, but I think what finalized the decision for me was the fact when I met all the older students and I just felt like this great sense of community and so I felt like I belonged. So I said, you know what, this would be the place for me to go to. I really wanted to broaden my expertise in biochemistry. I did uh, chemistry as an undergraduate and I knew that what I really wanted to study for a PhD um, was human health and nutrition. So this program was a wonderful fit for that. Everyone here in the department is always open to collaboration of some kind. They always want to help you, they always want to push the science forward, and, and they're always willing to do something. There is a good camaraderie between students and faculty that I wasn't necessarily expecting or didn't know what to expect, but I can definitely be on a first-name basis with several faculty uh, without their feeling like there's a power gap, and I can come to them for advice or mentorship. There are a lot of resources here at the U. I feel like not only just for your science, but also just for your health and also your mental health as well. There's an Office of Professional Development here uh, through the medical school, which has been wonderful in providing us a lot of different online opportunities during this time, as well as before COVID, there were a lot of in-person seminars. My research experience in the BMB program has been almost like a roller coaster. Uh, there's been a lot of high highs and a lot of low lows. I've learned now that I have to have a lot of plan Bs and Cs just in case the first plan doesn't work out. And so not only is it preparing me for you know my future career, it's also just preparing me for life in general. Classes are going to be difficult the first year, but it's definitely been more of an easy transition into a work-life balance than I expected. So just don't be afraid of that and, and take it head on.